A Pasco Middle School had a very special visitor yesterday. In fact, it was the person the school was named after. Veteran astronaut Dr. Ellen Ochoa spoke with middle schoolers at Ochoa Middle School in a special and musical assembly. Cap KV's Riley Fitzgerald joins us live from the middle school. Riley, tell us about the two performances that took place at Ochoa Middle School yesterday. Yes, Jill, this was a very special visit, not only for the students, but also for Dr. Ellen Ochoa. She was NASA's first ever Hispanic woman to go to space and went on to become the director of NASA's Johnson Space Center. She's now retired, but she says she had a great time visiting the school that was named after her more than 20 years ago. You, you know, it's sort of the highest honor I can think of. Um, certainly, uh, you know, 20 years ago or so when I first heard about this, I, I couldn't have imagined a, a school being named for me. Dr. Ochoa says education was so important to her that having a school named after her was the best thing she could ever think of. Now there are seven schools named after her across the country. And not only a school, but a piece of music was also composed last year in her honor by Ochoa Middle School music teacher, Alan Madsen. We performed the first time just for the community. This year we got to perform it for the student body. They've never heard it before. So this was the school's first time to hear the piece along with Dr. Ochoa. The performance, she says, was... Oh, fantastic. Uh, what a great orchestra. And I was surprised at how large it was, how, um, how many students are, are interested in playing. And it sounds like Mr. Madsen's just doing a wonderful job. They were very nervous. Every one of them, even this morning, was saying, Mr. I am so nervous for this, but I could just tell by the smiles they really enjoyed it. In a predominantly Hispanic city and school, it was surely inspiring to have the first Hispanic woman to ever go to space, not only as the school's namesake, but also have her visit. Music has been a big role in Dr. Ochoa's life, and in fact, she still plays the flute. After the performance of Reach for the Stars, she picked up her flute and played along with the fight song. The um, previous band director here, John Nelson, he was the one that wrote the fight song and he had sent me the music a number of years ago. And so when I've been on assemblies before, um, because he knew I played the flute, he, he asked me to sit in. So, uh, so I'm glad I got another chance to do it today.